Right, okay, I'm going to show you how to add links. So hopefully you received something like this through the post. You would have received um, two, two lots of leaks, leaks a, uh, an autumn leak and a winter leak. It's the autumn leaks will be ready for harvesting around end of November and the winter leaks will go right go through and be able to harvest them over Christmas in January and into February. Uh, first things first, we've got our raised bed. Um, so we're going to plant a square. So just, I always find it handy to actually mark out the square that I'm going to plant into. Again, uh, follow your instructions and you'll see which square you're planting your leeks into. Uh, for leeks, we're going to make nine holes and we're going to make nine quite deep holes. So I've got a, a wooden spoon that I'm going to use to actually make the holes. Um, so if you imagine the nine spots again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm going to make a nice deep hole. I'm going to make it about, about 15 centimeters, so from there to there, deep. And I'm going to have to make the hole sort of quite big because we're going to put the roots down there. That's the hole, and then we're going to get four or five leek plants, depends what you have. There's four there. And we're just going to put them into the hole and push them down all the way to the bottom. So there we are. That's the first set planted. And we're going to do that for each of the nine holes that we have. So let's do one more. Another four. One, two, three, four. Let's put, push them down to the bottom of the hole there again. And um, the reason you push them down to the bottom of the hole is that the, the leak that grows under the ground is the white part. So the deeper it is, the more white part of the leak you have. And then you've got the, the green part is, is the, the bit of leak over the ground. So I'll, do, I'll continue on, I'll, I'll sew all this. Just on the, the nine holes and everything. And so now what I'm gonna do is give them a little water in. Now with leaks, you don't have to fill the holes. So just, if you have a look at this here, I've actually left the hole I haven't pushed the, the soil back into it because what's going to happen is the leeks are going to grow into that hole. Um, so just a little dribble of water down each hole. And it's going to pull a little bit of soil down with it um, and give the, the roots a bit of moisture as well. And that's it. That's me done. Now just again, just to emphasize that when you, you're going to have two types of leeks, make sure that you only plant one type of leek into each hole. Um, the reason being is that the autumn leeks, uh, if, you, if you want to harvest, say, one autumn leek and there's two winter leeks around it, you're going to have to harvest the whole lot together. So try and keep the winter leeks to one hole and the autumn leeks to, to another hole. Okay, that's us done.